Hey, fish fam. In this video, we will be going through our NFT Ethereum staking flow. This feature allows stakers to mint an NFT, which then represents a physical validator, which can then be sent to a different address if you wish to change wallets or sell the validator without withdrawing it. Let's get started. Right now we're on the Stakefish homepage. Click Stake32 Ethereum, which will take you to our Ethereum landing page. Here you'll want to click Stake32 Ethereum again. This is the page where we can start staking. As you can see, we have two options. Classic staking, a tutorial for which can be found on our channel, and NFT staking. For today, we are going to be doing NFT staking, so go ahead and select that. Now we want to make sure that our wallet is connected here, which indeed it is, so let's get started. You can choose how much you want to stake by clicking here, and you'll see a card pop up. You can now increase the amount you wish to stake in increments of 32. So, say you want to spin up more than one validator, click the plus button here. You'll see more NFT cards have shown up, representing how many Ethereum validators you will be staking. This is a big advantage NFT staking has over the classic flow, as each physical validator is represented by a unique NFT. For today's example, we're just going to do one validator. Once you set that, click Stake and Mint. Read through the terms and conditions, and once you are comfortable with them, check Accept, then click Confirm. A notification will now pop up in your wallet for you to double check. You can't see this on my screen, but I'm now clicking on Confirm Now. Great, transaction submitted. Now let's view the progress. We can view the status of our validator on Etherscan, or we can go ahead and check out the Stakefish dashboard here. In the dashboard, we can see all our validators and all the Ethereum we have staked, all in one place. As we can see here, our NFT validator status is deposited, meaning it's currently waiting for the beacon chain to process the deposit. As you can see, our validator's status has now changed to pending, so we can now take a closer look at it. Click on View Details, and you can see the status of this validator. Your NFT will also show up here. Take a look at it, it's got some cool graphics. Once the status changes from pending, when the beacon chain activates it, which can take anywhere between 4-6 to six hours, sometimes longer depending on the length of the queue, we will be able to look at it as a full-fledged, fully active validator. Let's find another one of our NFT validators that we spun up previously. We can see this one is active. We'll just use this one as an example. So this NFT validator is fully active and is available in our wallet to transfer to other parties or other wallets if we wish to do so. It looks like we have some fees waiting to be collected from our NFT. Let's go ahead and collect those. We can do that by clicking collect here. A notification will pop up in your connected wallet. Check the details, then go on ahead and confirm the transaction, which we will do by clicking here. Now a total of 0.163629136 Ethereum will be transferred to our wallet. Fantastic. So now we've claimed those. If we have any other rewards we can claim, we can do that for all our validators by clicking this claim button in the dashboard. Now let's take a look at the withdrawal process. If we wish to withdraw this validator, click on View Details and click on the button with three dots. Click on Exit and Withdraw. This will show the Exit and Withdraw page for that specific validator. We can go on ahead and check our details here, check Confirm and press Request Exit. Confirm the transaction in our wallet. We can see the transaction is now broadcasting to the network. Our withdrawal request is confirmed, so now we can go back to the dashboard and see that our validator status has changed to exiting. In the dashboard, you can always view the details of your exiting validators throughout the exit process, which is estimated to take three to five days. Once that's complete, you can come back here and click collect to withdraw the funds withdrawn from your validator. That's about it for our NFT staking flow. It's a very streamlined process, and support is available at all steps along the way. If you need further help, feel free to join our Telegram community. Thanks so much for watching, and thank you for staking with Stakefish.